the traditional marriage ceremony of Isaiah Sabo Ibinedion and Bob Chibuike Unwagu, having held in color and pageantry on Thursday, September 24th, 2020. The white wedding was set for Saturday, 26th. The grand wedding, which held at the New Estate Baptist Church, Gudu Abuja, had both families well represented with lots of dignitaries in attendance. Among them were the governor of Edo State, Godwin Obaseki, and other seven and former governors, past and seven senators, diplomats from other countries. The list is endless. The presiding bishop, Bishop Idou Akintola, urged the newly wedded couple to build their home on God's teachings, noting that the reason some marriages face challenges was not due to lack of love but lack of knowledge, after which he joined the couple who exchanged wedding vows and rings. Duly considering the cause for which matrimony was ordained. Firstly, it was ordained for mutual society, for help and comfort that one ought to have of the other. With this ring, I beg you, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Speaking after the church service, the newly wedded couple, Isaiah and Bob, expressed profound gratitude to God for the precious day, while promising to love each other till the end of time. Our love keeps going from strength to strength, and we live in happiness and peace forever. Amen. I feel amazing. I feel blessed and thankful to all our family and friends who have come out to celebrate with us. May God bless you. Family members, friends, well wishes, and all the guests then moved from the New Estate Baptist Church to Myra Event Center located at Asokoro for the grand reception in honor of the couple who were led in with a dance by their friends as well as the bride's siblings. <laughs> It was a moment of joy and merriment for all with the father-daughter dance as well as the mother and son dance. High points of the occasion was the cutting of the cake, the couple's first dance, the toast, which was anchored by the bride's sister, Chief Osasu Ibinejo. Parents of the couple, while speaking with ITV News, offered marital prayers to the newly wedded couple, charging them to put God first in all they do. Uh, it's a new phase of life for her, so it is my wish that she has a blissful marriage, very successful and peaceful, and um, may the good Lord give her the fruit of the womb and give her all the happiness that she deserves. I wish them a beautiful home together, a lot of love, a lot of children, a lot of blessings from God Almighty. We have come together, we will live together. She will not regret being such a family too. It's to live as peaceably and lovingly as they have started and to seek the face of the Lord following the three C's that have been taught them today. My wishes for them is everything they wish themselves, everything that their heart desires. I pray that God answers according to his will. Obviously their home will be fruitful in Jesus' name. I wish them a lovely married life. I um, pray for kids, for them, peace of mind and every good thing that marriage comes with. Some guests who wish the newly wedded couple a happy married life extolled the sterling qualities of the Ibinedio and Uwangu families. Knowing the type of uh, okay. parents too that have brought them into the world, you know, these are accomplished people, they are God-fearing people. So I have no doubt that these, you know, their children will do well in marriage. I'm wishing the couples well, wishing them more fruitful years, happiness, joy, excitement. They are public figures, they have produced governors, 
and the man himself, that's the Benedio, is an institution. So they are blessed to come from that family. I wish the two of you a very blissful marriage, a very fruitful marriage. I decree and I declare that your children shall surround your table. What more can one say than wish the couple a happy married life? Osawona me ibizubi. ITV News Abuja.